Hey everybody, today we're making shark liver oil. It's a super healthy uh, supplement. Uh, you can buy it online, but if you're catching dogfish anyways and using it for meat or bait, you may want to just make your own. I'm going to show you how to make it today. This stuff is really healthy. It boosts your immune system, good for your skin, um, all sorts of benefits. I'll put a link uh, down below and you can go check out the benefits of taking shark liver oil as a supplement. So here's the dogfish that I'm going to be harvesting the livers from. Uh, if you slice across right behind the eyes, you'll hit their brains and kill them pretty quickly. So to spare you the gory details, I'm just going to show you what I harvested out them. You just cut open the belly and you get these. So as you can see, you get quite a bit of liver for three sharks. Okay, so I got my shark livers. I'm going to blend them up now. This is the first step in the process. Once you've harvested them, you just want to break it up, boil it, and then we'll uh, separate the oil from the water. Now we have a nice liver slurry. Not sure if you can see that. And let me tell you, this smells wonderful. Okay, so we're just gonna let that boil for an hour or two covered and uh, I'll get back to you when it's done boiling. All right, here it is, an hour later. You can see the oil starting to render there. All right, there we go. There's a nice layer of oil on top. I'm going to show you the easy way to get the uh, oil separated from the liquid there. Okay, so first thing we do, got to do is uh, strain all the chunks out of the oil water mixture. And then I'm going to put the strained mixture in a bag. Damn it. So I was doing this and I forgot to uh, separate it and I'll show you that now. I was filming and I forgot about the uh, straining step because it's been a while since I did this and so it stratifies into three layers and then the chunks are um, in between the water and the oil whereas here you can see the water and the oil are separated there are a little bit of chunks but that's okay um, we'll get rid of those I'm just gonna let that sit for about half an hour or so it should uh, separate a lot more. Okay, so after that, this is what you're left with. Um, try to get a close up there. You can see it's a little murky. Um, unfortunately, I don't have any coffee filters. I'd uh, pour this through there if I had it, but that's okay. Um, it's just gonna be a little more flavorful. So the dose for this stuff is a quarter teaspoon per day. In the description, I put a link to a site with all the benefits and stuff. And they say a tablespoon is too much a day and that'll give you high cholesterol and blood pressure. I've taken that much before for like a month and I didn't notice that, but I don't think you notice high blood pressure. But the proper amount that you're supposed to take is a quarter teaspoon. I'll take that much right now. It does have a like a it tastes like the shark. <laughs> anyway, so you get a lot of um, you get a lot of doses out of that, and I'm not going to eat all this. 
This wasn't actually all the yield. I actually took out, uh, I wanna say a quarter cup and I used that for bait. Caught the shark. So I'll probably use lots of it for bait because this is too much for me to consume. I'll be fishing for sharks for a couple more months and uh, yeah, I'll have a lot more livers. So hopefully this video helped you and now you know how to make shark liver oil. You don't have to buy it, although you, most people probably aren't buying this stuff, but it's super healthy. Give it a try. Till next time.